we have a superior school. There is no other way to describe it. Superior. And I've heard it said that, well, you know, besides 30 minutes a day of religion and going to church on uh, Wednesday morning and a prayer to start school and a prayer to end school, your school's just like every other one. I'm sorry, I beg to differ. The, the school is staffed by a group of just the finest Christian people. They set the atmosphere and the culture of that school. Every expectation and goal in that school is Christ-centered. And in the middle of all that, they manage to educate the kids who are there. And, and I don't mean just they come back a year better off the next year. The eighth grade class averaged on the, the test that they take to measure their achievement. They averaged the max. Not one or two kids. The class averaged the maximum score. So not only do they get the religious part of it, but they get the academic part of it. And I can tell you that back in the old days when I was the chairman of the Board of Ed, I got to hand my daughters their diploma, knowing what had gone on at that school. That was something. And now that they're married, have their own families to see them carry on as adults, it was good that they went to St. Paul Lutheran School. I think uh, you'll, you'll hear that from anybody who has sent their kids there. Is it a sacrifice? Oh, you bet. It absolutely is. Is it worth it? Absolutely. So if you can manage it, I highly recommend it. It is the thing to do. It's the place to be. It is a superior school. It is the school in this town. I've seen the scores from lots of schools in this town. It is the school in this town.